What's up, y'all? Today I got myself a burrito torta. You know I love burrito tacos. You know I love sandwiches. This could be a winning combination. The only problem is this place has not been tested. I just saw it for the first time. I think it's a new spot. Just saw it like I just peeped it today and it only has one review. So this could be bogus, but I'll tell you what, it's looking pretty decent. And uh, I would be remiss if I didn't try it and document it because this thing could really be on us up, man. I'll tell you what, like I said, is looking good. It even comes with the consomme over here, which I feel like will be an awesome dip for this sandwich. Comes with a couple chips, uh, some green salsa over here. And I also got this. This is a pineapple agua fresca. Never really heard of that before, agua fresca, but I guess it's a popular thing. I just didn't know about it. This all came out to 20 bucks. So let's see if the price is right. Uh, this is looking nice i can't lie this is looking very good i take off this foil the only problem is it's small man this is like a sandwich for ants i can't lie but you know what <laughs> you know it is what it is i didn't know what to expect but this is definitely small korean sizes i guess let's take a look under the hood real quick i'm not sure everything that's on here you got looks like you got some meat obviously we also have some lettuce and some tomatoes and sauce it looks like here's what the consomme is looking like looking great i'm gonna go in for the first bite uh without the the consomme here and just see how it is and then i'm gonna go in for the dip yo all right Forgot to mention cheese. This is messy. This is a messy one, y'all, but this is this is mighty fun. Oh, that tastes amazing. You can taste the TLC in that meat. It is a little bit messy, but other than that, this thing is be this thing be eaten. This is only gonna get worse once I dip it in here, but let's just try to keep it as clean as possible. Mmm, okay. All right, y'all. This is almost crucial. This takes us up to the next level. This is crazy. That's real crazy. This is, uh, so here's the thing. Like, I didn't grow up eating tortas because they, I couldn't find them. I've never seen them on menus. I've probably seen them on like three menus in my entire life. I probably had it like once or twice. Once. No, I didn't try it. Didn't even try it at that time, but I saw it on the menu at Playa del Carmen. Once I tried it, I seen it and I tried it at the Taste of Chicago. So this is like the second time I've had a torta. And why aren't there more tortas? Maybe I just wasn't looking in the right spot, but or everyone just defaults straight to the tortilla, which you know I ain't got no problem with. But eating something like this with the, the sandwich form, with the bread form, but you get all that nice, like, Mexican flavor. I love that. Mm. That's real good. Mm. Let me try this drink real quick. Oh, that's solid. I think basically what this is, like pineapple juice, hopefully freshly squeezed, mixed with some water, maybe a little lime, sugar. This is like one of the top 10 most refreshing things. You can see the foam at the top, so I'm thinking that means it's uh, freshly squeezed, freshly mixed or juiced. That's delectable. Mm. I haven't had Berea anything in a minute. This brings me right back. Mm. 
I'm gonna save that bite for the end. Kill these chips real quick. This is also a fire. I'm glad I did not sleep on this place. One last bite here. Just, all right, this, this goes just so deep. The flavors and the texture just combine in a way that We'll just knock your socks off, no joke. I'm definitely gonna be eating this right here. You can see, oh, there's a, it's like a slice of lemon. Shout out hot lemons. I'll tell you what, this has gotta be rising up to potentially my favorite style of Mexican food, right? Like, like if someone asked me like, what's your favorite Mexican food? I would just say like anything burrito almost at this point. Maybe I'm a little prisoner of the moment, but I'm about to go edit this real quick while I sip on the rest of this pineapple drink. I'll tell you what, that was mighty fine. Um, I don't even think this was probably even close to the best potential possible form factor you could create this sandwich in, a burrito torta and if you got skills, I mean, you could probably create it even better, but all the uh, all the fun fundamentals are there, just a little bit small. I feel like a little bit of an upgrade on the bread would have kicked this up to the next next level, but still, uh, mighty fine. One order was definitely not enough. I could have ate like two or three more whole sandwiches, to be honest with you, but that, the price would have got out of control, and it is what it is. I'm skating, though. Thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.